Welcome back guys to Clover Creek, our dedicated server, and now super exciting times. This is, uh, we're opening up the combine shed here, the harvester shed. We have the sugar bee harvesters, then the rest we're going to be using for, um, obviously we have the deer, the ideal, the new haul, and the case. I think that's it. I think we have four combines. I honestly want to buy like maybe two more. So first things first, everything is ready to harvest here. Let's go. There we go. Okay, so we have corn, corn. I believe that's barley then we have beans 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 corn beans i guess we only own okay this field right here sunflowers we own these fields um but yeah we have so much to go we're like today i'll i'll get started on harvesting but pretty much today is all prep work everything is just getting ready getting the headers ready getting everything maintenance washed everything ready to go because once we get it going saturday we're gonna officially start the harvest now i guess i'm probably gonna get in the field today i will probably i'm getting in all the combines for sure like i said prep work and then i'm gonna probably buy two more combines because just the amount of craziness that's gonna uh, maybe not two more maybe just have five because right now we have four i think five would be a good number and then three people obviously need to be somebody at least needs to be running the uh running like grain carts running semi trucks and moving our grain because we can't have everybody out in the field obviously that would be a very bad situation okay so right now i'm looking for what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna set up all of our headers perfectly in a row so that when people get on here it like it's easy i'm actually going to change the password to our server real quick so that it's uh so nobody can get on and like harvest all the fields and i know that's kind of bad but saturday we will be streaming probably like forever and we'll just be harvesting this and if we need to buy more combines when that day comes we will but right now i'm going to set up everything for i'm going to set up everything for corn because we need to knock out these two fields first and then we can switch over to barley but i think it's best to set everything up for uh for corn we'll go ahead i might as well just unfold things make it look official We'll lower it down just so it's easy storage not really storage we're just gonna set these here for now i should probably clean them off with the power washer i will do that very shortly and then the only harvester in here we're not gonna be using is the sugar beets because last time i checked there were sugar now it's corn which is fine but I, then i looked here i was like oh some people must came on the server but no there's nothing in our sugar beet like storage area super confusing don't know why that was there maybe maybe there weren't sugar beets even planted there in the first place and i'm just going crazy i don't know All right now we're in the s790 oh no i should probably oh wait the pipe doesn't fold in okay yeah i totally forgot the deer pipe doesn't fold in so right now the combine is folded but the pipe is like extended let me drive please there we go okay i needed to be just a little more careful there do all the other pipes fold? Yeah, all the other pipes fold besides this one. It looks like it folds. Er, no, honestly, it doesn't look like it does fold. All right, let's go get a corn header for this. I should have a corn header for uh, for everything. And then I should also have... I always forget what they, you call the other headers. But I should have... Ooh, I have two I have two deer headers for, uh, for beans and stuff. So, honestly, our other combine... Let's just look in the combine section right now. It's, it's always so fun just shopping for things. Let's go to harvesters. All right, so we need something pretty decent size. I was going to go down to the T560, but it holds. I might as well just get two S790s, I was thinking. So we one, two, three, four. And how big is this guy? He's much smaller. I think we're going to stay in these bigger classes. Yeah, it really dips off. 625 horsepower, 380. I think we're going to stick with the big four here, and then we'll get a fifth John Deere. Let me just buy that right now so I don't forget. So I think we have tracks on we have duels on it right now i'll throw tracks on just oh i don't have enough money oh no we're gonna have to lease it for now that's fine that's fine we're gonna make so much money off this oh wait i already have tracks on this one i don't even have duels oh well we're doing double tracks then i can i i'll just uh you know what i'll take this to the shop right now this needs harvest uh this needs maintenance and fuel too super weird um i think I think I, th I think this makes sense there there's been some harvesting going on if I look in my let's look over here we have more wheat and barley super uh way more sunflowers than I had earlier and then if I look over oops no not not yet Clarence we harvested this so a lot of people come on here guys and I don't know like what's going on exactly that's uh 
it's not a problem it's a good thing but sometimes people like leave their equipment out so if you guys ever play on the server and you guys easily can so saturday when we stream anybody can be on here but the problem is obviously we can't have 50 people on the server you wouldn't be it would be frame by if a, a frame a minute would probably be our um okay i need to back this guy up to the workshop better and i probably should make sure that i'll detach from this all right there we go go ahead repair we will also customize it we'll throw twin wheels on it i know you guys will really appreciate that look it was no more expense those two and then let's okay what i'm thinking i want to make sure that the header is 100 percent. so a, a thing that i ran into right away and a lot of other people did so right now i need to repair this too there we go it's only five days old anyway if you you might be able to repair a combine like say say you're in the field and you do multiple fields multiple seasons and and you're out in the field and all of a sudden your combine knocks down it usually runs at six six miles an hour and knocks down to th so low and then you go and repair it and then you hook up to the same header you go back out in the field and nothing changes you're like what the heck spencer told me that I, everything would be like fixed and, it, and it's not and that's because you haven't repaired your header we ran into that problem early in the game we were able to figure that out so just a tip to you guys if that's ever happened to you which i'm sure it has um that might be the cause so there we go we got new holland its header is a few few rows smaller i think it looks to be anyway let's tab back over and we're in the ideal i think we yeah we had tracks on every single one of our combine i guess I think I bought all the combines, but I don't remember saying like, oh yeah, I'll do tracks on all of them. I think all of them here, that was super weird. I was just kind of waste some time, but yeah, track tracks, tracks, and then I guess all three of those have tracks. Maybe I should have just kept the tracks on the, no, it's fine. You guys will like it, but we could have been an all track team. Oh, is there room? All right, we'll try and fit in here. Really bad organization on the headers. I want to fix those. But let's try and get this video to around 400. 500 likes and uh and we should have a good stream on saturday so once again guys saturday is my normal time i stream which and i will be streaming at 5 p.m central standard time roughly around there so make sure you uh factor that in when i'm gonna stream because if you live on like on the coast or a whole different country you need to factor that in okay i think this is the is this the biggest header this looks to be the widest very cool all right we'll go ahead unfold the rest of the combine and then we'll jump back over here there we are the 9240 boys i got the hat to match it it's not a case hat it's just a red hat that i found i don't know i just kind of wanted something there and then where are my headers are right over here so pretty much this is the prep work that we're doing i need to go grab the other combine as well and header organization is huge we'll, we'll be hooking up to the other headers shortly not right now but like after we get done with corn so we'll everything will start off we'll just do corn and then the rest will be uh all that other stuff so let me get all this organized and i'll see you guys in a second all right so we're on our way back down to the farm and i'm the only person on here right now typically guys we will have like you know five six seven people on here and we'll have that many people on here during the uh during the live stream so unfortunately this this is this john your header doesn't like fold up which is fine there's not too much traffic and if there is i'll just pull off on the side of the road and and they'll drive right by but i have my hazard and my hazards flashers and everything on so i think we should be good it's a, it's a distance not gonna lie it is kind of a hike but oh well, well we'll be able to make it so everything's pretty much set up i'm just trying to run through a few more things in my head that we want to get done and kind of secured away for for saturday obviously we'll be doing multiple other things like on the side and stuff that we always have to prep for i think everything's like repaired up to to like the most and what i'm thinking guys once we get all these fields harvested like then we'll kind of slow things down uh we'll have livestock super important probably halfway through the through the through the harvest we'll start livestock uh start buying them especially because we'll have i'm sure we'll have like eight nine people on here uh oh there's a guy all right duck your head all right i think we missed them no we actually we just went right through them anyway 
we'll have a lot of people on here so i think we're going to be able to do a lot of things like at once and stuff so i don't know the uh the setup is pretty good the farm is insane this is pretty much what like five to ten million dollars looks like and that's our farm so we went all in and i i want to keep continuing to buy more and more equipment too and i want to do like cool things like tug of wars we need to get those mods in here with the with the poles and stuff and then a lot of other things with those as well trying to do some creative like equipment things so let me know in the comments what you guys what you what like if you have any cool ideas like that that's always awesome uh when we planted we missed a few spots but honestly it's not that big a deal i'm not picky like whatsoever i know some of you guys watching aren't but all right i'll be at the farm in like two seconds all right so here is the setup guys just about to pull in now it's the big five besides besides we have a twin in the crowd the only difference between the deer combines are the dual wheels and the tracks no big deal though but this is uh this is the setup i don't know what else we need we might need more no we i think we're good on the grain carts honestly if we stick to one like crop type at a time so like we knock out field six move over to field seven and then what i want to do everybody put on a uh just like your your soybean header or whatever i there's there's a good name for it and we all knock out field 47 and then we fold up and then we go down and we come over to field eight we all knock out field eight in like two seconds field nine 23 maybe maybe we'll keep we'll do six seven and 23 just so we keep all the corn right there and then and then maybe we do we do the barley here soybeans beans and beans and that's probably it honestly i don't want to mess around too far down here honestly i would rather harvest you know these two fields or purchase these two fields but we don't have the money just yet maybe we will go down here and knock out all these fields we'll, we'll kind of see how that plays out so there we are guys it's pretty much set up I'm just going to I'm gonna start honestly real quick I just I'm gonna do the outer laps on uh, on this field on field six probably maybe scoot over field seven and do the outer lap as well but honestly just trying to get some harvesting footage here for you guys and uh, super excited for Saturday so put that in your calendars your notebooks your phones that we will be uh, we'll be live streaming Saturday 5 p.m. Central Standard Time probably until like we're gonna live stream for a very very long time like all the way pretty much all the way until we get all these fields done which will take a long time but we're gonna have five five combines in the field which is pretty crazy and we're gonna be able to knock out you know this field in i i would think under 20 minutes almost i i mean they go i mean six miles an hour but still five five combines that's pretty crazy and we're gonna be able to knock it out quick so i'm gonna do a quick little tab ups of me running around this field and then uh and then, yeah, I will see you guys in a bit. Jump into the car on a Friday night. I want to drive with you. Looking for a bar in the nearest town. I've never seen a sky so blue. We don't have a plan and the night is young. It doesn't matter what we do. There ain't nobody like. There ain't nobody like. You look so beautiful. So lucky to be yours And you're taking me high Ain't nobody like you I'm not coming down Ain't nobody like you I could go a thousand miles As long as I'm with you Yeah, you're taking me high Ain't nobody, ain't nobody like you Talking
All right, guys, so we're just getting back. <laughs> that lap actually took a pretty long time. I don't know how quick we're going to be able to knock it out, but it's going to be a really interesting stream. It's going to be it's going to be a good stream. It's going to be very interesting how quick we can do all this with five people in the harvesters just running and gunning and we're going to we're going to be harvesting a lot of crops. We have pretty much everything 100% fertilized. We're going to be getting we're going to be getting I think this is the only field that was 50%. I think we forgot to do this field the 100 100 100 like all these are 100. Let's look. Um soil composition. Yeah, all these are 100 besides this one's weird. Not really sure why, but Hopefully you guys did enjoy today's episode. I will see you all on Saturday for the stream. And hopefully you all have a great day. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button on your way out. Please subscribe if you haven't already. We're on our way to 200k. That would be awesome if we can hit that uh, one bit faster if you hit the subscribe button. So thanks guys for watching. Hope you all see you in the next one.